What's up, YouTubers? Um, gonna do a update, a redo update on uh, my last video I did because uh, I got a better camera to use. And yeah, so Junior's in this cage, and his lights turned off because it's on a timer over there. But he's in there. I don't want to take him out because he just ate. Um, here's the iguana. He's right here. Doing good. The turtle. He is right down there. He's doing good. Still eating. Not growing much, but doing good. Um, I got a bunch of mice. Uh, like 15 or something like that. They're all in there. Um, I got two rats in there. I'm going to try to breed or something or get some bigger ones. I don't know. And this, my collection's starting to grow a lot quicker than I thought. So I'm going to start breeding rats again. Um, here's this thing that I got. A showcase thing. The only thing wrong with it is right here. This little piece right here is broken. I just gotta hot glue it. But yes. And then on the top tub as usual is my female. Get out of the light is my female focus. I know is my female hypo early 2011 a lot nicer than she was i tell you that much um, let me take her out there she is I love her uh, let me put her in the light if you can see that how she has the gray grayish black on her head, you can't really see it. Well there you kinda can, but she's got like a grayish black shadow type of thing on her head and I love that about her. Her great tail here. But yep, that's her. Doing good. Go back in here, I can see you spilled your water. your water too is the uh, late 2010 male albino 100% anery take him out just like most albinos it's hard to see their color and everything but you can see his really nice yellow I love their eyes because the light shines down through it. You can see the little light spot underneath, or you could. But yep, this is him. He's still got his pattern, so I'm hoping that he keeps that throughout his whole life here. Because I know most yellow out and the pattern washes out. You see your tail. I never would have thought I would have got him for how much I paid, but I am 100% happy because this is one of my favorite morphs of boa. I'm a sucker for albinos. Yeah, he's doing good. The guy I got him from off Craigslist did not take very good care of him, so he's quite skinny, so I'm getting him up there. Say hello to the camera. <laughs> But yep, that's him. Set you back. Yeah, no. Oh, come on. There you go. And then my new addition. My late 2011 compared to 
KC, which I'll pull out again in a minute. They're both 2011s. Female Motley. My favorite bow born of all time. I finally had the money to buy one. Great looking Motley. I love her. In real life, when you look at her, the blackish brown on her, the little coloring throughout her makes the lighter gray stand out a lot. Like almost 3D looking. She's got a great stripe on her tail. Got great side markings and everything. But let me show you her next to KC. Let me go. As you can see, early 2011, late 2011. Big difference. Well, that puts her in the light so you can kind of see both of them a little better. I'm hoping to read KC to Saga and get some sun glows or something and then eventually Saga to Kira, I named her here. But yeah, that's an update. Um, comment down below with any questions, if you want me to make a video of anything. But yeah, um, peace out guys.